look at that, horsey. Oh, hi guys. Today is my is one of my videos of Dabs for Creativity Season 5 to 6. And that is the Hurricanes. Yes. So, in the last video, I said that we would do Pacific Hurricanes. Because last video was Atlantic Hurricanes. This video is going to be Pacific Hurricanes. That's right. It's your turn, guys. If you live in California, Mexico, Guatemala, El Salvador, all the way down to pa Panama and Colombia, and even Hawaii. If you live in those countries, it's ready for Pacific Hurricanes. So I have a question, Horsey. How do Pacific Hur How bad do Pacific Hurricanes get? Well, I think it's because the warm water and dry air comes up like like tornadoes and uh, and and Atlantic hurricanes like the last video. That's right, horsey. So, like if you watched the last video, you know that all storms start off as invests. So, invest so invests are the same way as Atlantic hurricanes, like Invest 95L, Invest 99L. Then, and if an Invest shrinks, not all of you, but if an Invest shrinks, it becomes a, tr a, a, a depression. A the tropical depression would be called like tropical depression one, two, three, four, a thousand, a thousand, one, a thousand, two, a thousand, three. Why do I keep doing that? I don't know. He's usually like this. And now, trop tropical depressions are, if they shrink in, not all do, but if they shrink in, of course, you'll see a tropical storm. Tropical storm Ovo in 2019 just wandered off really. And tropical storm Alvin wandered off too. By the way, we go, um, Pacific Hurricanes goes to Z. Atlantic Hurricanes only go to W. So that's one difference between these two. Now, back to the category. When, if Pacific tropical storms strengthen, not all do, but some strengthen to become a category one hurricane. Let's think. Nah, let's just get that. A category one hurricane has the same wind speeds as an Atlantic hurricane. That's 75 miles per hour to 95 miles per hour. Right, horsey? Right. Anyway, next thing, next one, some not all do, because we're getting pretty rare now, but if it strengthens, it'll become the category two hurricane. And that is not as powerful, like, Category 2 is the same as the Atlantic, like, 90, a uh, guy goes 96 miles per hour, all the way to 120 miles per hour. Um, oh, it's 10.04. I am drifting off, I'm so sorry. Now, now we become a major Pacific. Now this is called a major Pacific hurricane. A major Pacific hurricane is categories three, four, or five. Now, category three is pretty powerful, I'll say. It's the first thing to a major hurricane. But if a category three strengthens to a category four, striking to a category four they're not all do but it is kind of rare they become they become a category four and things start to get creepy. once category fours are getting a little creepy and a little too powerful and that's a little rare right horsey right
Okay, that's too a Brit that's a little too much British accent for you. And then Category four Olivia in the season of two thousand eighteen when it hit Hawaii, and it was powerful, I bet. Now, the worst hurricane of Pacific hurricane of all would be a category five. It is so it's still super rare to have a category five hurricane, right, horsey? Right. I'm from Oxfordshire. Blah 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 blah. He's getting a little too carried off. Now Category fives are very powerful. In 2018, Category 5 Hurricane Lane was very powerful. It destroyed a lot of stuff, and like usual, it's 150 miles per hour to one to all the way to 200. Or if it gets even, if climate change gets even worse, a, a Category 5. Soon, we're going to talk about climate change and how that's changing the earth in very different ways. Or, some people like to call it global warming. I'm so excited to teach you about that in the next video. And it's causing a lot of extinction. And that's a little too much information for you. Now, next will be um, see episode 3 on Pacific Typhoons. That if you live in Russia and China, you're in there. Bye. Now I'm going to go to the park. Bye. Yo, don't jump on my bed. Great. I'm going to go to the park.